incorrect entries or irregular patterns in your employee's attendance can be corrected with attendance regularization. All your employee needs to do is raise a regularization request and once it is approved, the wrong attendance entry will be rectified. This is an easy, time-saving and error-free way to correct attendance discrepancies. There are two steps to set attendance regularization in Zoho People. The first step, settings for attendance regularization has to be configured and a regularization approval process has to be set up in Zoho People. To configure attendance regularization settings, log into your Zoho People account and from your home page, go to Attendance, Settings, General Settings. Here, you can do the required setup under Regularization Settings. You can enable the request to be raised for a future date or set the number of days within which you want the request to be raised. Also, you can restrict your employees to use regularization only for the set number of times here. You can enable and customize the reasons for the wrong attendance entry and also the way in which you want your corrected attendance entry to work. Once this is set up, don't forget to click Submit. Now, your attendance regularization is set up. Let us add an approval to the process. To do this, under Attendance Settings, click on Regularization. Click on the Add button on top to create a new approval. This is similar to setting up all other approvals in Zoho People. Enter the name of the approval and set the criteria here based on your attendance policies. You can restrict the option for a particular role, for a designation alone, or other options based on the number of times an employee has regularized over the month or the year. Under Approvals, you can configure the approver. Select the approver from the set of system fields from the drop-down. This can be set up for multiple levels too. The regularization request can be set up to be auto-approved as well. Enable follow-up if required. You can add a message to the approver here. Click on Configure Email Template. You can create a new template here, add in the required form fields and create your own message or choose from an existing template. This is a default template that is already available with a simple message. Add any attachments if required and click Save. Now you have successfully configured an approval process. Whenever an employee applies for regularization, the request will go for approval to the set approver. Let's see how employees can apply for regularization. There are two steps to this. A regularization request is raised along with the corrected check-in and check-out entry, the reason for the discrepancy and other details. The raised request will go for approval to approvers or will be auto-approved based on the set approval process and the attendance entry will be corrected. Employees can raise a regularization request from their attendance tab. To raise a request, navigate to Attendance, Regularization, My Requests and click on Add Request on the top. Here, select the employee whose attendance entry has to be corrected and the period Select the date for which the attendance entry has to be rectified and enter the correct check-in and the check-out time. Select the reason for the wrong entry and add a description explaining the error. Click Submit at the bottom. Now the request is raised. It will go out for approval to the set approver or it will be auto approved based on the settings. Managers and administrators can approve such requests from their accounts. Using the My Approval space here, all approvals of your employees and reportees can be approved or rejected. Here they will find a list of all requests that have been approved or rejected and they can click on the particular request to approve or reject them. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more.